Hi, I'm Deborah Lightfield. I live in Ponte Vedra, Florida. I've been an artist all my life in one form or the other. I was I'm from a generation where women weren't supposed to be working. So art, I was allowed to go to art school by my father because I could be a, a better wife. Uh, but I did go professionally into jewelry and metal work for 20 years. I'm a gemologist. Went out to California to get my certification and designed and made jewelry. After that, I uh, got my, I had had my t teaching certification as well. So I taught for 20 years. Um, that has always, I think, made me a better artist because in teaching, I, I wanted to make sure that I could teach realistic to abstract. And in my artwork, I have done that. Right now, I have found a new process called ocean wash, and that is done in the ocean. And I'll show you some examples of that and show you how I do that. But the ocean actually helps me paint the artwork, and then I do my magic after that. Um, but I've always been a creative person. I believe that accidents even in artwork make you a better critical thinker and accidents can be your greatest successes. So I, I go with the flow in life that way as well. I try to be a, a positive person and I try to have that reflecting in my artwork. Um, music is real important to me. Music is an audio thing, but I think it's also, to me, a very visual thing. Um, I want you to hear the music in my artwork. I uh, like expressing myself and being a part of the world without making that sound too hippie-like. Um, I do believe that it is a God-given talent, and I, I hope to use it um, for other people's enjoyment as well. Ocean wash is a new process. I believe I'm the only one in Florida that's doing it right now. But it's a beautiful process, and since the ocean is my soul, I love that my soul is literally and figuratively and visually put into the artwork. I take the watercolor paper, and I found out recently I can also take canvas, um, and I'll put that into the ocean, literally, and the ocean will wash up sand. I take that uh, paper or canvas out of the ocean, take it up to the dunes. Uh, occasionally my paper and canvas has washed away, so I've had to do it two or three times, so that's why I put it up on the dunes, um, or not quite the dunes, but uh, away from the ocean. And I pour the acrylic paint on top of it, different color palettes that I think I might enjoy. I have no idea what it's gonna look like until four or five days later when I sweep off the sand and then I can see some images in there, and that's what I start painting. The one that I'm gonna be painting today, it's so obviously this seahorse, and the customer has an area that she wants to hang this. She has another piece um, as well, so I have that next to me so I can refer to it that also has the greens and the blues and the yellows in it. Um, and I really wanna go with the flow, uh, see what the image and the paper and the colors are telling me to do and see what happens because a lot of it is just that whole inner artistic uh, expression that emerges almost magically as I do it and um, that's the fun part for me. I'm Deborah Lightfield. You can find me on Instagram, Deborah Lightfield, L-I-G-H-T-F-I-E-L-D. Um, I have my own website which is lightfieldart.com and also I have a Facebook which is lightfieldart on Facebook.